Hello and welcome back to Dueling Saturdays and we finally have it! After who knows how long we got the ritual event. Now, uh, it's Necros. <laughs> I'm gonna change the Necros deck a little bit. Primarily because we do not need her. We don't need uh, three of these guys. One unicorn is fine just because if we get uh, to use a telescope to get to Held of Arclight. What I want is, I want multiple, I want more Gugnirs. I got Armory Arm, uh, not Armory Arm, Divine Armament. Oh, sorry, Decisive Armament. And I'm thinking like two of these guys just to get more consistency going. Uh, evenly matched, I think it's going to be a great addition. This is gonna be embarrassing. Uh, what the fuck? Huh? No! They bend evenly? No way. No shot they bend evenly. Let me see. They bend evenly matched. Oh no! Okay, so not evenly matched. Uh, that's fine. Um... Pot of which pot is allowed? Uh, pot of wow, pot of ex mm, they're really not allowing us to have pots, huh? Okay, how about foolish burial? Uh, hey, there we go. So, I'm thinking like double lightning storm is good, or maybe compulse. Uh, I don't like, I don't like. Maybe I should keep... Okay, so first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to remove this one. And I'm going to add myself the, the second... Uh... What the fuck? Oh, uh, Forbidden Chalice, Forbidden Chalice... It's just bad, no, it's not. So I think this deck has consistency. I think. And its primary goal is to more use like Gugnir and uh, Trishula. Trisha is amazing. And like Brio, instead of going for Unicorn. Now, I do realize that it's going to be extremely hard to win the game with Necros. Primarily because I should not be playing. I should be playing more Trishula. But if you've noticed, I don't have a lot of Ultra Rare points. And I don't know what to disenchant. First of all, I can't disenchant this. Or this, because he's a foil. I'm not going to disenchant foils. Actually, quite hard for me to see which one I disenchant. Like, I'm, I'm full. Like, I'm stacked. When it comes to like ultra rares, I have nowhere to go. I guess Labyrinth is a good option, but I want to make a Labyrinth deck, so I'm never gonna do that. Uh, actually, this one is not bad to disenchant. Nadir Servant, we do want. I mean, I do need it for maybe someday making a Dumatica deck, which is never gonna happen, but I might do it. Actually, am I using Secret Password? No, I'm never gonna use Secret Password. That one can be dismantled. Never in a million years will I be using Secret Password. Uh, Naturia Mole Cricket. What deck uses Naturia Mole Cricket? I do not know, actually. Unironically, I do not know. Uh, Enter the Kaiju Slumber. I do not know if I need that one. I do need Ghost Ogre. Mm. Let me see, let me see. I'm starting to do this on video, but I'm just, I'm just trying to see... If any of the cards are missing, just so I can make the second Trishula. Like, if I can make the second Trishula, it's gonna be based. Uh, I cannot have, I cannot make the second Trishula. Actually, unfortunate. Um, uh, I wish I could disenchant these guys, trust me. Oh, I wish I could do that, but I can't. I have triple of these. What do these cards do even? I don't even use Trap Tricks at all. Or you! I mean, okay, so what are the higher chances? Me playing Evil Eye or me playing Trap Tricks? I'm not playing Trap Tricks. Sorry, Trap Tricks. Goodbye. If I use it in a deck, oh well. I want Trishula. Like, I should have just want Trishula. And uh, let's remove this one. There we go. Wait, what? Oh, yeah, right. I need to make Trishula right there. Basic non-finish. Oh, well. And let's do it. So this deck is more focused around Trishula than uh, Unicorn. Let's see how it goes. I love Necros. Like, Necros is my favorite ritual deck. 
Although Sheena birds have been growing on me. Sheena birds have been growing on me. I could make a Sheena bird deck, like a pure Sheena bird deck, which is like actually a good idea. I didn't think about that. Uh, oh, wow, that's a straight up uh, Gugnir or Ardbehair. Ard that's pretty good. Huh? Uh, okay. <laughs> All right, I mean, uh, <laughs> someone brick. You know what? You know what? I would love to see. I would love to see Megalith. Megalith would be based to see. Ooh, Kaleidoscope unironically is good. I can. I can force. Oh wait, no, I can't. Wait, actually, no, I can. I can. I can force them to do something. But no reason to play anything. Like seriously, no reason to play anything. You know, I'm waiting for lightning storm, right? Or that. That's actually pretty good too. Okay. Okay, okay, I have it, I have it, yeah. Uh, Necros of Cloudscope, let's go. Ash? Ghost Bell? Cold buy? I mean, okay. I did not expect a cold buy, but sure. Torrential. Um. Okay. <laughs> Second cold buy. No shot second called by. Infinite permanence? Maybe. Oh no, it's destructive co Huh? I mean, this is a good card. Very good anti-linked card. Very good anti-linked card. What? 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 Labyrinth? Labyrinth? In a red short? Why? Oh, I'm mad now. Now I'm mad, actually. Why would you allow Labyrinth in a ritual event? Why? That's like me playing Guru. Oh wait, no, Guru would be banned. You know, Guru would be too strong. It's like, excuse me, Guru is too strong. What the actual fuck? Why would you allow... Why? Are you actually... Why? Nah, nah, Konami is now... Mm, okay. Uh, actually, good card. Sure. Let me guess. Uh, oh.
Why the so they're fully they are allowing you to play full power labyrinth in this deck. In this event. Cool, cool, cool. Ice Dragon Prison! Oh, they're not none of them are limited. None of them are limited. Wow. <laughs> How do I go into Trishula? I can't go into Trishula actually. They really went with. Oh, yeah. Here's a ritual uh, event. By the way, Labyrinth is allowed. You know, the most, one of the most powerful or most potent trap decks in the game. Yeah, they're allowed. Dad. Oh, wow. Wait, what? Why? So, um, why is this event even a thing? Can we talk about that? Can we talk about this event being a thing if you're gonna allow trap? Why? D d yeah, yep, just keep saying them, yeah. Keep saying them, like there's nothing I can do, keep saying them. Yeah, yeah. Cool shit, cool shit, cool shit. Um... Cool shit, cool shit, can't play anything, I'm dead next turn, cool shit, cool shit. Um... I mean, what do I play? A actually, what do I play? I mean, I'm dead, obviously. Now I'm actually curious, what is his deck? I'm actually curious now, what is his deck? Is it pure labyrinth? I'm I'm gonna guess it's pure labyrinth. Like I would play pure I would play pure labyrinth if I was in his in his position. Because if labyrinth is allowed, like full power labyrinth is allowed, why wouldn't you play it? Why wouldn't you play it? What I mean, why wouldn't you? Am I right? Uh Yep. Yep. Full power labyrinth. Wow. Talk about just shitting all over the event. Why would you even want to play ritual if you can play labyrinth? That I don't understand. Like, I would not play labyrinth. I would not play ritual then. I would, I wouldn't play like necros or any uh, non-specific ritual decks. I would just want to play it. I would play labyrinth. Just tell me Brand is also loud and we're gonna have a beautiful time. Konami be like, yeah, we want people to enjoy rituals and explore ritual decks. Oh, by the way, we're gonna allow like fusion sound. Oh, I mean fusion decks aren't allowed actually. We're gonna allow like trap decks. Yo, fuck it, why not? Hey, finally, someone playing a ritual deck. I'm sorry, that tilted me so much. Oh, that tilted me. Oh, that was so annoying. So annoying. Um, okay. Okay. Uh... Okay. Um give me this.
<laughs> I mean... Hey, at least the man tried to play Ritual. I respect that. At least the man tried to play Ritual. And not bullshit trap deck. I respect that. Can you please have more Ritual jank and not... Fucking trap decks, please. I have nothing against Labyrinth. I like Labyrinth. I like the theming. But this is a ritual event. I want to see people duke it out with rituals. My favorite summoning uh, uh, mechanic. I want to pe see people duke it out with rituals. I want to see Necros get... <laughs> I want to see Necros finally get some support, damn it. They deserve at least a trap card, you know. Come on, Konami, give us a trap card. Preferably a, a one that allows us to use opponent's cards as a ritual material. That would be really cool. <laughs> Very cool, in fact. Um, Axe of Fools? I mean, sure, let's see what you're gonna do. No! No, you're not playing Bankai OTK. You are not playing Bankai OTK. Actually, I respect Bankai OTK. And morons, Mikanko, like, duh. Uh-huh, sure. How do I out Mikanko, by the way? No, really, how do I out Mikanko? Like, I don't know how I out this. I, I really don't know. How do I out uh, this deck? Well, I mean... Uh, if nothing else, Trishla is live. So let's go Trishla. Oh, I wish I had... I wish I had Royal Rare in Trishla. Trishla is awesome. Non targeting, not like not anything, you just get to banish. Granted, it is, you know, you have to have the conditions met, but it's so good. Um, mm, yep. Let's go! Okay, okay. Actually, good hit. Actually, good hit. Um, give me Bryo and then give me you. <laughs> I mean, um. Uh... <laughs> Necros, ladies and gentlemen. Necros. Uh, pretty cool. Pretty cool. Let's go third game. This is gonna be the last one for Necros, because I have a couple more ritual decks to play. I have a lot of ritual decks I want to play for this event. So yeah, I'm I'm stacked, as they say. I'm ready. I might actually make a Shinobur deck. I'm gonna see if I'm allowed to make a Shinobur deck, and if I am. Oh, we're making it. <laughs> we are making it. Uh, <laughs> actually, good hand. Like I can go into uh, Erbeher or Trishla, uh, no problem. Uh, all right. Part of prosperity is interesting. So, so let me get this straight. So this card be used to ritual summon any. Uh, this card can be used to ritual summon any necro ritual monster. Tribute once from your hand or field. So this summons from the graveyard. What I need is the mirror. Okay, so I need the mirror. Which means I'm gonna activate part of prosperity. I need the mirror, not the cycle. Mirror is more important. 
unironically. Ash? I mean, yeah, please ash me. No ash. Mm. 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 Um. Yeah. Uh, in that case, I'm summoning uh, Art the Herder. And there's Ash. This is useless to me. What I need is something else. Gishki! Based! Based! You know, if I was expecting that he had, uh, that he had uh, Ash, I would have played something else, honestly. Um, uh, okay. <clears throat> My own Ash does jack shit for me. Um, okay. Can he look at my hand? Oh, look at your opponent's hand. Okay, well, I mean... I wonder what he chooses. I have a feeling he's not going to choose Ash, just because if he chooses Ash, that means he has something to play next turn. And if he cho he's not going to choose the ritual spells because, I mean, come on. That's just giving me free uh, recycling. I mean, actually, what would be the point? I don't have Shirit, and Shirit seems to be the best card of this deck. Unironically. It's Abdahur. Okay. I mean, I can do it, so let's do it. So, we're, so this is basically a duel of successes of the Gishki versus the Gishki. Cool, cool, cool. If this guy's normal special summon, you can special summon uh you can special summon one Gishki monster from your deck, except Gishki Grimness. Also, you can only declare one. No. Okay. <laughs> uh, uh, uh huh. Triple tactics talent or oh wow. Okay. Um sure sure. I mean, you can't activate two triple tactic stats. Oh, pre-preparation of rights. Oh, wait, this gives you any normal sp Oh, wow. That's a good card for my going second deck. Or for, for the Necros deck, too. All I can say is never mind, because apparently Necros are that powerful. You know, don't give me the trip, the the trap deck, and we're good. All right, so let's go from a different deck now. Let's make a new deck. Let's make the Shinobir deck. Uh, Shinobir. Let's see which ones are all allowed. All. Oh wait, 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 w
So all of them are allowed. That's good to hear. What does this guy do? If it's a uh, monster control, turns you have all this. Okay, you can target one party for control. That's right. Now, when monster clears an attack, you can spare one spirit monster from your graveyard, negate the attack, then end the battle phase. Um. Okay. Uh. Two of these. Two of these. Uh. Now, this person summon once per turn, you can target one of the spirit monsters on the field, return it to the hand. Once per turn during the end phase, it discovers no. Uh, mm -hmm. Who cares? Uh, you can draw one card once per turn during the end. Mm, who cares? Can this person summon per Wait, what does this card do? Spirit monster you control him, okay? If this step you control turns to hand, you, know, you can add one spirit monster or ritual spell from your deck to your hand. Uh, yes, please. In fact, give me three of these. Give me three of these. Uh, you can discard what's this card attack comes equal to attack that card monster. I mean, okay, so unfortunately, the spirit monsters are actual shit. Like, this is the best one because it has to draw a card. So, we're gonna do this one, and let's just do the other one, these, and then we're gonna do spirits. Oh, actually, no, pre. Uh, I'm not gonna play pre-preparation pre pre of right. Uh, preparation of rights. What I'm gonna do is now I'm gonna move this and I'm gonna go with spirit. Where is spirit? Where is spirit? There is spirit. Are you all banned? Huh? Wait, what? That was weird as fuck. Okay, so spirits are allowed. So that means we play the best spirit, which is Amano Invado. That's a lie. We're gonna play three copies of our boy Aratama. We're gonna play three copies of Nikitama because Nikitama allows us to special normal summon an additional spirit monster. Unfortunately, I don't have Sakitama. Sakitama is fucking insane because uh, you can reveal this card in your hand immediately after this effect. Normal summon one spirit monster from your hand. If this card is tributed, target one spirit monster from your, uh, to your hand. So yeah, this card is not this card you can, uh, you can only okay. So yeah, you can reveal this card in your hand immediately after this card. Normal summon one spirit monster from your hand, and I think this card can be used. Uh, where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? This card can be used to tribute some one monster. Yeah, crazy. Now, do we play Amaterasu? Amaterasu requires two spirit monsters, which means it has to be a combination of Nikitama and Sakitama. Because Nikitama allows you to speak a normal summon one spirit monster in addition to a normal summon, and then uh, Sakitama you play to allow you to, to continue with the combo. We're not going to do that. Uh, what What is the, the rest of the cards we're going to need? We're going to need drop. We're going to need Manju. Definitely. What the actual fuck? There you go, Manju. So, triple Manju... Uh, light, uh, uh, Ash Blossom, of course, that's, uh, that's a given, Triple Ash Blossom, uh, called by, cause we hate hand traps, uh, and Dark Hole is a big one, uh, Triple, Triple Dark Hole is an amazing one, actually, Triple Dark Hole, give me right, uh, give me Lightning Storm, yeah. Huh? There we go. Give me double lightning storm. Give me Raigeki. And then give me one feather duster. There we go. So this is a... What is this? A going second or going first deck? I think a going second deck primarily. I could be wrong. But this is all about like, you know, basically getting to the ritual cards. Which are insane. Shino birds are insane. They have insane effects, actually. Um, yeah, I think this could be kind of cool. So let's do it. Let's make this one. Thank you very much. Oh, I was about to say, give me a foil. I was about to say, give me a foil, but okay. So yeah, let's try to use it. Let's try to use it.
Great. That's great. I wanted to go second. We're going second. Awesome. Watch me brick. Watch me brick. Um... I mean, this is a combo. It's not a good combo, but it's a combo. <sighs> why is uh, why is rescue Ace playable? Can we talk? Can we talk about the fact that rescue Ace is playable? That's a bad card. Um, all right, activate Shino Bird Power Spot. He's playing Shino Birds. Oh no. Normal summon Nikitama. He is really thinking this, okay. Uh, <laughs> gotta be honest, I did not expect to see Solemn Judgment on the Nikitama, but sure. Sure. Mm hmm mm hmm Am I dead? <clears throat> and now he's gonna add four different... I mean, it's, it's an insane effect. Like, adding four different to spell and traps is insane. Yep. Wait, this is actually a shit card. Yeah, Shino Bird support cards are actually kind of shit. You want the other ones. Anyways, uh, normal, I mean, active Dragon Q. Huh? Who am I playing against? Oh, and this guy is this guy can be or is it a hydrant? It's the hydrant. Can't be the Shirabella, right?
don't worry this is only for once i'm just gonna do one duel like this i have i mean i have like comp like not competitive but like prepared decks i just think like i was thinking like maybe i can make a a, a deck ready for uh a shinobird deck but you know bitch this is not a mandatory effect oh it's a you can't go fuck yourself yeah rest case are are good they're good um yeah let's actually play a more uh, streamlined deck shino bird support cards are actually kind of bad or main monster cards are really bad no uh, what you want to play is um uh, like the new shit that's gonna come yeah, there are a lot of four rituals. Okay, so where's my Nephthys? Let's go play Nephthys. Oh no, what will I do? The, uh, the evil match is banned. Oh well, you banned. Okay, you banned. 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 Um, I don't need you. So give me the fur dash. Give me the fur dash. Actually, 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 uh, uh, Huh? Nephthys. There we go. Uh, actually, give me two of these and then hit me with one of these. There we go. Now let's play a Nephthys deck. Which is a really cool deck, actually. I like Nephthys. I like the bird. The ritual bird. I like it a lot. I like the literal bird more than I like the uh, uh, the flounderies. That I hate that deck so much. Like I genuinely do not like the fl the, the flute deck. I really do not. Mm, yeah, okay. I mean, honestly, I don't know what can someone do. I guess mm, uh, unironically, Trishula outs my uh, outs my deck. Unironically. Okay, so ritual summon uh, ritual summon no summon manjo the ten thousand hands. No ash. No ash. Unironically, no ash. Rebirth summon conductor of Nephis. User our boy Manju. Why did I summon defense? Doesn't even matter. Active effect. Ritual summon the um, the other girl. The devotee of Nephis. Activate the effect of devotee of Nephis. Uh, who cares? Uh, activate the effect of pre, -pre preparation of rights. Uh, give me this and give me back my uh, yes, please. Give me the ritual of Nephis. Sorry, rebirth of Nephis. Watch him have uh, a kaiju, but oh well, we live or die by the kaijus, so um, shit's real. Sacred, a uh, cerulean um, sacred bird of Nephis. Ritual summon the, the flame bird. Uh, that's basically it. Now, um, he can out it. Kaiju, um, Trishula, um, anything that doesn't target. Non targeting, non destruction destroys. Oh, wait, 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 let me see, let me see. Can't be destroyed by battle, can't be destroyed by card effects, need a play, yeah. So, yeah, non targeting removal fucks it up. Uh, Chaos Max? I mean, Chaos Max? Not enough. Not enough. Stop saying Chaos Max, he's not playing it. Stop saying Chaos Max, he's not playing it. He is playing it. <laughs> Luckily, Blue Eyes does not have non targeting removal, so we're kind of good. Chaos Max Dragon! Let's see it. 
Let's see the boy. You know, I wish Konami would use more effects that says if you use this specific card, this card gains a shit ton of like effects. I like those kind of effects. There he is, Blue Eyes Chaos Max. He's not playing Chaos Max, stop saying it. Are you are you actually stupid? Have you have you read Nephis? <laughs> have you <laughs> fucking hell. Have you read the Sacred Bird? Okay. Like, actually, have you read the Sacred Bird? The uh, Sacred Flame, sorry. Didn't you hear? <laughs> the bird is the word. Huh? Oh, Dynamondo, okay. Okay. Um, um, the bird, ladies and gentlemen, the bird. Let's continue. Uh, this is gonna be a long ass video just because I love virtual decks. It has to be a long ass video. You know, I think it's like I have three ritual decks ready, which is the most I have of any deck type, I think. Yeah, yeah, it is the best, the most one. So yeah, of course it's gonna be a long ass video because I'm gonna play with all three of them uh, the, the going second Shinobird deck which is completely useless because who the fuck is gonna combo off in a ritual deck? You know what ritual deck actually combos? Huh? Okay I mean, sure. I guess someone bricked. Won't be the first time a ritual deck bricks. Um, this is very cool. And what's the final reward? It's, is it... Uh, yeah, it's the name. Meef. I thought she was going to say beef. Uh, yeah, first, Nephis wants to go first. I mean, do you? I mean, yes, yes, you do. But then your opponent can, you know, cudge you for that, cudge you for your dear life, so. Eh, it's debatable. This is, uh. This is a hand of all time. Okay, uh, I think I, I know how we're gonna do this. Uh. We have the combo, so activate the effect of incantation candle. Better have it. Better have it. <laughs> so, um, unironically, this is the most consistent my, uh, my deck has ever been, the Nephis deck, honestly. Bird is the bird. I'm not gonna sing. I'm not gonna sing the song. Well, I mean, uh, 
I hope you don't uh, you don't kaiju me for dear life, cause uh, you about to get the bird. There it is, the bird. I dare you. I double dare you. Out the bird. I'm gonna open our drink. Bear with me, please. Cup of Ace, always part of greed. Always part of greed. But unironically, it's always part of greed. Uh, yeah, yeah, okay. I mean, uh, yeah, that that was Nephis. I mean, <laughs> what the fuck? What is going? What is going on? <laughs> uh, Sheena Bird going second. Which ones are banned? That's okay. Uh, so, uh, pot, point, pot of, uh, thank you so much. And now all we need is extra deck, which means, uh, link. Fusion, next was the actually Synchro 2. What do you mean? <laughs> That's so weird. Um, yeah. Okay, um, Triple Mundo, why not? Why not? Why not? Why not? Why not? Why not? Uh, why not? I mean, it's a going second deck for fuck's sake. What 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 do you think it was gonna do? Like an extra deck summon? As they say, uh, going second, let's go! Actually useless cards. <laughs> I'm joking, these two are useful. And this one too, but this, I mean, the, okay, so one useless card. Sorry Nibiru, I know you don't want to hear that, but dude, you know... Who who is comboing off in a ritual deck? <laughs> there is no comboing off in a ritual deck. You just don't do that. Um, unless you're Drytron. Uh, if you're Drytron, then yeah, you do ritual. You do uh, combo off. Uh, but uh, incantations and Drytron—that's kind of too much. Uh-huh. Yep. Uh what are you playing? M based actually based actually based player. Actually based. Hold up. Yeah, so this might this is gonna be the last duel of the video. Unfortunately, but I have some uh, errands to do. All right, so where we left off, uh, Megalith Fool, I think is like the game. Uh, he, they, I think, like, 
She starts the game for the Megaliths, I think. I don't know how Megaliths work, I really don't know. All I know is they're based. They're a based ritual archetype. So, <laughs> remember how I said, uh, you know, who the fuck combos with rituals? Uh, I'm a moron, you know, don't listen to me. Clearly there's someone who combos with rituals. I bet he's also asking himself, who the fuck plays Nibiru in this event? Like, I'm guessing he's also... Oh, 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 okay. Mm-hmm. Chaos Max? The question now is, can he keep going? The answer see the answer seems to be yes. From the deck. Oh, never mind. He's adding a, he's adding a. a oh, it's pre preparation. Yeah, sure. Stop saying chaos, Max. He's not playing it. Stop saying chaos, man. I'm, I'm gonna play chaos, Max. Okay, I think I'm I'm leading on the point. That I'm gonna play chaos, or I'm gonna try to play chaos, Max. Okay. Shino bird, <laughs> Shino bird, let's go. Base deck, let's go. Wait, what can I summon? Who cares? Spell phase. Mirror force me. Okay, so uh, no mirror force. He's gonna ritual summon. Okay. Sure. Shino Bird! <laughs> He's also playing Shino Bird! Stop saying Chaos Max, he's not playing it. I'm summoning Chaos Max next turn, don't worry about it. He 
he knows I have Lava Golem. He needs to kill me this turn, basically. Because otherwise, I have Lava Golem. I can go Incantation to Chalice Mandra to... Uh, sorry, Chalice Main. A uh, Chalice Slime to go into Chaos Max. And that's basically game. So, he better have it. Sure. Sure. Wait, what? Oh, wow. Okay. Yep, beach, um, pitching Benton, sure. BF4, I have no idea what it does. Oh, he gets to destroy them, I see. Wait, what? Oh, he pops the field, okay. Well, I mean, uh, as I said, he better have it, because um, Chaos Max is happening next turn. Mm -hmm. Okay, so he doesn't have it. All right. Stop saying Chaos Max, he's not playing it! I mean... Stop saying Chaos Max, he's not playing it.
Oh, that's what he had. I forgot the. Oh. Hmm, okay, I did not know this was a kick effect. I'm gonna be honest. I didn't read this card. I did a classic Yu-Gi-Oh move where I just didn't read the card. Okay, okay, this makes it more interesting. And unfortunately, I don't have time to continue this because I'm kind of running out of time. Um, yeah, well, that's GG. Yeah, GG. Um, I guess I could have went with my, uh, with my other card, like I should have went with, like, huh? Yeah, I'm dead. The GG, GG Megalith, GG. Dude, I have 50 HP. Just stack. Thank you. Like, just stack me. Mm hmm. Yeah, GG. Yeah, uh, so I didn't read. <laughs> I didn't read the card effect. <laughs> Classic Yu Gi Oh! move. I didn't read the card effect. Oh well. Uh, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please leave a like, subscribe, leave a comment. I greatly appreciate the support. Goodbye.